Hello everyone, welcome back. It's TGR, that's Gaming Robbo. Today we're going to be going through the hidden gems from Thailand on Championship Manager 0102. Now just before we do start the video, if any of you do use Facebook or Twitter, give us a like and a follow and of course subscribe to our channel as well as hitting that notification bell as well. Well apart from that, let's start the show. Let's see the hidden gems from Thailand on Championship Manager 0102. So guys, as I mentioned before, obviously we're going to be going through the hidden gems from Thailand. Now just before we do start, make sure you smash a like on the video and of course, subscribe if you are new to TGR, that's Gaming Robbo, and hit that notification bell as well. Well guys, let's start the video. Let's see the hidden gems from Thailand. Kosin Hathair Atin Akul. Now he's 19 years old. He's playing over at Tobacco Mon Monopoly. He's valued at £30,000. On a part-time contract for £210 a week. Now Kosin... He is one of the top players within this team. Now, his stats don't really look that much to be desired for. But his potential ability is 169. So he's going to be making the Thailand national team a brilliant start you know, for the defensive line, of course. But Kosin is obviously my goalie. Let's have a look at my four defenders, starting with my left back. Tanonsk Prajakata. Now, Tononsk, he is 25 years old, not a stranger for the Thailand national team, playing his football over at BEC. Now, he's valued at a quarter of a million pounds. On a part-time contract, he's getting paid £2,300 a week. Now, his potential ability is 101. So, you might be thinking he might be playing close to his potential ability already. Far from it. This stats at the moment shows his ability is 30. So he's still got a lot of growth to go within his within his statistics. But Tanonsk is my left back. Let's have a look at my right back. Jeffrey Promayun. Now Jeffrey's playing over at Eindhoven. Now he's Dutch and Thailand nationality. I've selected him to be my right back, even though he's 29 years old. There's no age limits when it comes to the hidden gems list. Now, Jeffrey is valued at £725,000. He's getting paid £2,100 a week. But he does have a non-promotion release clause of £825,000. <clears> now, Jeffrey's potential ability is 140, so he also is going to turn into a really good player for the Thailand national team. But Jeffrey, it finishes my fullbacks. Let's have a look at my two centre-backs. Nirut Surisang. Now, Neerut, he's playing over at BEC. He's 22 years old. Not a stranger to the Thailand national team, but he is valued at £300,000 and he's getting paid £2,600 a week. Now, Neerut's potential ability is 136. Now, he's going to turn into a really good player for Thailand's national football team. But Neerut is one of two centre-backs I have on my list. Let's have a look at the other one. Nived Siriwong. Now, Nived is 23 years old. Once again, he's had a few occasions playing for the Thailand national football team. Playing his football over at Sembawang. Now, he's valued at £275,000. He's getting paid £600 a week. Now, Nived, his potential ability is 113. But still... Saying that, looking at his stats, he's still a really good player to have in the Thailand's national team. But Nived finishes my defensive line. Let's have a look at the midfielders, starting with this one. Panipal Kurjam. Now, Panipal is 28 years old. He's playing over at Tobacco Monopoly. Obviously, he can play as defender, but he can play as a defensive midfielder. So I've selected him to be my defensive midfielder. Now, he's valued at £85,000. He's getting paid £1,600 a week. <clears throat> now, Panipal, he is the lowest valued potential ability player within my team. His value is at 85, but I've been struggling to find 
a defensive midfielder for the Thailand national team. Now, Panipol is the only defensive midfielder. Let's have a look at my two central midfielders, Adol Lukicna. Now, Adol, he is 27 years old. He hasn't played for the national team yet. He's playing his football over at Ratana Bundit. Now, he's valued at £45,000. He's getting paid £350 a week. Now, Adol's potential ability is 136. So, you can already see that it's going to be a massive jump for him compared to how he's playing right now. But Adol is one of two central midfielders. Let's have a look at his partner playing in the other role of central midfield. Nopadol Kumjapol. I've tried to say his name right. I've been saying it a thousand times in my head. But he's 28 years old. He's playing over at Thai Police. He's valued at £30,000. He's getting paid £170 a week. Now, even though he's 28 years old, his potential ability is 123. So there's still a vast amount of progression for, for him to be able to grow within the statistics within himself. Now, they finish off my two central midfield area. Let's have a look at my attacker midfielder, Suti Suksomkit. Now, Suti is playing over at Tanjong Pagar. He's 21 years old. He's obviously played for Thailand already. He's valued at £450,000. He's getting paid £600 a week. Now, Suti's potential ability is only 112, but yet already you can see that Suti can develop into a fantastic player for the Thailand national team. For Suti finishes my midfield line, let's have a look at my last two players up front, starting with this guy. Pipop on Mo. Now Pipop is playing over at BEC. He's 22 years old. He's valued at £210,000. He's getting paid £2,600 a week. Now Pipop's potential ability is 118. So you can see he's still got a lot to progress with, of course, but he's not going to be an absolute worldie for the Thailand national team. Well, saying that, the next player, the last player on my list, for Thailand, he is a worldie. And it's this guy, Tiratep Winathai. Now, Tiratep is 16 years old, playing over at Crystal Palace. Now, Tiratep's value is £675,000. He's getting paid £1,100 a week. Now, even though he's playing over at Crystal Palace, Obviously, he's going to be valued more. He's going to get paid more, of course. But his potential ability is 148. So he is going to be one of the one of the few worldies within the Thailand national team. Anyway, guys, that is it. That is it for the Thailand national team's hidden gems list. If you have liked this video, guys, please make sure you smash a like. And of course, make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell as well. So you know when the latest video has been uploaded to our channel, guys. Well, apart from that, guys, thank you very much for your time. I look forward to seeing each and every one of you at our next video here at TGR. That's Gaming Robbo.